Welcome to Poker Night. If you guys like playing poker games with your buddies on Friday and Saturday nights, and you're looking for a new game to play, I'm going to teach you how to play a game called the Iron Cross. Um, my friends and I play it. It's a fun game. Pot builds up quickly. Let's get started. I'll show you how to play it. Okay, here's how you play and deal the Iron Cross. Uh, you're going to determine uh, whatever your ante is. And then you're going to determine uh, if it's a center card of the cross is going to be wild or not. You have to determine that before you deal. We'll, we'll just call it uh, a hard face value card and then I'll show you the difference in, in the end. So everyone's going to get two cards face down. And then you're going to deal a cross in the middle of the table. It doesn't matter how you deal the cross down. Just so it looks something like that. Now that's going to be all the cards in play. Now in order to get the bet started, I like to go counterclockwise. So this guy right here is going to bet or check. We'll see what he's got. 10 and 8, he's probably not going to. 10 to 5, probably no bet there. 9 and a deuce, suited. Uh, this guy's probably going to bet. So that's how the betting gets started. So this guy's going to bet. Everybody else is going to call. And that's how it's going to play on every round. So you can turn up any of the outside cards first. Uh, the center one's going to be turned to last. So you can start here or here, it doesn't really matter. So we'll turn that one. So now, since this guy bet on the last uh, betting sequence, uh, he has first chance to bet. So we'll just say he's going to bet. Everybody else is going to call. And now you're going to want to turn over a card in this row, either the top or bottom, just not the center. So now you got Ace showing. So we'll say this guy's going to bet again. Everybody else is going to call. As you can see how much the pot's building. Uh, you're betting on every single card, and it works out pretty well to a pretty well pot in the end. So now we're going to turn this one, since we started here, and we went here, now we're going to go here. Same thing, somebody's going to bet, we'll say player here is betting, everybody else is calling. And now we're going to turn this card. Same thing, this guy's probably going to bet. Everybody else is calling. And now this last center card, remember you determined before you ever dealt this if this was going to be wild or a hard face value card. So everybody's waiting to see what this card's going to be. So now every player is going to determine, uh, am I playing my hand this way or this way? Because you're going to take your two hole cards and make a five card poker hand. You can't use all the cards, you either have to go this way or this way. Whatever makes uh, most sense to your hand. Now if this was wild, uh, then all threes are going to be wild. It doesn't really matter if you go this way or this way, you're going to have the wild card. Now if it's a hard three, then you just play it out like a hard card. So now, there's another round of betting. Whoever was the last better uh, can bet, check, or whatever he wants to do. But we'll keep saying that this guy's been betting all along. He's going to bet. And everybody stayed in. And now whoever, so whoever has the best poker hand running this way or this way is going to win the entire pot. Let's see what everybody has. Dealer's got a pair of fours. 
So if I play my hand this way, I'm showing three fours. This player here, 810. Uh, looks like he's pretty much out of this no matter which way he plays. This player here, 510. He's pretty much uh, out. Nothing there either way. This player here, got a 2 and a 9. And obviously he has nothing going either way. So dealer has three fours running his hand that way. Now remember in the beginning if you made this a wild card, now dealer has four fours. So that's why you need to determine that in the beginning. So player with the best five card hand wins the pot. Like I said, pot builds up very nicely in this hand. Uh, All right, hope you guys enjoyed Poker Night and my instructional video on how to play the Iron Cross. Uh, if you guys want to like, dislike, comment, subscribe if you want to. Just don't splash the pot. Thanks for watching.